Here we go then, video three, new Gmail. Very, very simple idea and a short, small video with a huge impact. And if you type the question mark, this is what happens. Let me do it, three, two, one, go. And so what happens when you type a question mark is you get a shortcut window come up. One of the most useful, useful things that's been in Gmail from the beginning, but I wanna make sure it's working. One of the huge, huge things that I use all the time, dead center of screen, little hashtag thing, gate, call it what you want, and it deletes an email, which is really, really fast, really, really useful. Bottom line, that was it, look, question mark, it comes away, press escape or um, click anywhere else, it disappears again. If you're wondering where that was, then you can come back and, oh, here we go, keyboard shortcuts. Keyboard shortcuts for the actual link, which is lovely, but you'll notice that you have to read the whole thing and then they've got actions and um, things that you have to read. So bottom line and finish this video is anywhere in Gmail, hit question mark and it will go like this. Have a good old read and you'll also notice, just slowing down a second, is the following keyboard shortcuts, shortcuts are currently enabled. So, and it says disabled. Let me slow down for a second for the last 10 seconds of this video. In settings, you go in and to get the extra ones in the main general tab, scroll down and it says, look, keyboard shortcuts. Now I've turned them on and by default, I think they are turned off. If you click more, then it will bring you the help page 6594 which look is exactly the one that I just opened up. So bottom line is let's end this video, have some lovely fun in the brand new Gmail, if I can even speak correctly with question mark, question mark, question mark.